Turning now to the historic day in space. Three paying customers and a former NASA astronaut docking with the International Space Station and welcomed aboard. The four-man crew blasting off Friday, set to spend 10 days in space. The private astronauts each paying $55 million. They'll be enjoying the view, but also performing experiments. Here's ABC's Phil Lipoff. Go Falcon, go Dragon. Tonight, success. After a first of its kind liftoff that launched three paying private space tourists to the International Space Station. One meter to go. This morning, their SpaceX capsule docking successfully 250 miles above the Atlantic Ocean. A real estate mogul from Ohio, a Canadian investor, and a former Israeli fighter pilot escorted by a former NASA astronaut, each laying out a staggering $55 million for the 10-day trip. The astronauts in awe. It's hard to find, find the words, but uh, it's been an amazing journey. We understand there's a responsibility, and the responsibility is for this first civilian and crew to get it right. The trip, chartered by the startup company Axiom Space, isn't just for fun. Each private astronaut completed months of training and will assist in experiments being conducted on board. Still, they will have time to enjoy that multi-million dollar view. That $55 million ticket doesn't guarantee access to the Russian side of the space station. For that, they're going to have to ask permission from the three Russian cosmonauts on board. If all goes as planned, crew and capsule will splash down in about nine days off the coast of Florida. Whit? That'll be quite a sight. Phil Lipoff, thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.